Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. In today's video, we're gonna show you how to find all five collectibles in the Path of Persistence here in Jedi Survivor. So without further ado, let's jump into it. So we're gonna start from the beginning of the Path of Persistence. You guys can see we have the Anchorite base meditation point right nearby, so you can just use that to get over here. But once you get over here, we're gonna take the zip line to make it across. And once you get off the zip line, we're gonna grapple up to this ledge right here in front of us. So we can come up here and grapple. We'll then go to this floating grapple over here. And then we're going to go right over here to the left side where we're going to have another grapple. And once you get up on this ledge, we're going to have a chest right here, which is going to be your first collectible. Now, after you open up this chest, we're going to turn around. We're going to hit the floating grapple again, and we're going to go right back over here to the main platform. And we're going to work our way all the way to the back, and we're going to be able to grapple again. And when you get up here, you're going to have a bunch of stormtroopers. You'll need to take those out first, as you're not going to be able to grab this next one until you take those guys out. But once you do that, right over here at the entrance to this building, we'll be able to scan and you're going to get yourself another collectible. Now, after you scan this, we're going to go inside and we're going to have a grapple up here on the right. We'll grapple up to this rock. You can jump across. You're going to have one stormtrooper in here to take out. And if you go all the way to the back right over here in this corner, we're going to have a treasure. Now, to get our fourth collectible, we need to start the puzzle, which is going to be right here behind us on the wall. Now, the very first thing we want to do in here is move this ball so we can use the force to push it. And that's going to open this door right here. We can come through this door and jump down. And then once we're down here, what we're gonna do is grab onto this ledge. We're gonna run across the corner here and we'll be able to wall run right here. So you can jump up on this ledge. We can wall run across and we're gonna drop down right here onto this ledge. And once you're down here, we're gonna come over here and use the force to push this ball to the other side. We'll then jump across. If you've already activated this zip line, you can take it. If not, you just jump up on the ledge and work your way around. So we'll take the zip line up once we're back in this room, because we opened this door, we can now jump our way up. So we'll jump up into this room again. And once we're inside, we're going to turn around. We're going to use the force to push this ball to the other side. That's going to open this door here. We can work our way through. We're going to wall run on this wall, and then we're going to grapple up. So when you get over here, you'll get the indication to grapple. And then you can just jump to the top of this wall. You'll have some stormtroopers up here you need to take out. And once you take out those stormtroopers, we can run right over here to the stairs. And all we need to do now is push the ball. So we'll use the force, push this ball down that way. While we wait for the stairs over here to open, we can pick up this collectible right here. And once you pick that up, we'll come right over here and these stairs are going to open up. So you can go ahead and pick this one up and now you've got all the collectibles. But this is how to get all five collectibles here in the Path of Persistence. If you guys have any other questions, make sure to leave them down in the comment section below and we'll see you guys in the next video.